Watch or skip to the end to find out who gets drafted into Tournament 2. Hello everyone, Huge Own One here, and today it is Friday, which means we are playing Minecraft. And today's announcements is today we are drafting the eighth player into our tournament. And also after I draft the eighth pl player into the tournament, two fifths of the draft will be considered over, which is around forty percent of what we're going to be playing with. So last time, if you don't remember, I almost died in the nether. I had like one heart left. But, but I got lucky. So I'm still alive. I need a better way to grow food though. Okay, what else should I do in this world? Um, not sure yet. And if you haven't noticed, this is the second to the last episode before I close off the series for season one of the um, Minecraft Survival. Which means after next week's episode ends, this world is not going to be on YouTube anymore. And we will transition to season two of this series, which will be twice as long. In a whole new world as well. All right, let's go to the nether, see what we can do. Hopefully I don't die. What way did I go last time? Definitely not down there. I have one blaze rod, which is good. But that's not enough. I need a bunch of them. Because I need to craft that stuff. I want to make at least 12. So that I have enough for the end portal. But, if, but of course I'm probably going to get unlucky and have my um, loot just... And we'll have those ender crystals blow up. But I don't know if I'll get to that in this season. I might have to do it next season. Because there's only two episodes left and I'm being attacked by a ghast. What a fun way to start. Gotta get through my little hole. Without getting blown up. Crap. Okay, I'm safe now. At least from the gas. It's not from the wither skeletons that could swoop behind me. The goal is to kill blazes. Right now I killed one and, and got some blaze rods. I need more blaze rods, of course. Oops. 
that is a zombie pigment. They're friendly. Unless if you hurt them. Now this is an oddly generated one. Let's go down here. There's a blaze. Let's kill it. Crap. There's only one way I can get in. I'm gonna make sure I don't get hit by him either. Alrighty, that's another blaze rod, which means we now have four of those. I need to kill more blazes until I get like 12 blaze powder, and then I need to go to the overworld or wherever endermen are found, which is pretty much everywhere now. Kill some of those until I get a total of eight ender pearls. Why is there a Oh, this is where I was attacked. In fact, that's the same blaze from a while ago. I'm gonna make sure he doesn't fall off. See, last time I was in this area and I got attacked. Okay, that's six of those. We still need... six more of those before I'm going back. Or unless if I'm at critically low's condition. Those are the stone swords of the, um, my, those bony little fiends that tried to kill me dropped. There is a blaze and I'm going to go f towards it. Eek. Not very smart. Where did it go? Oh, it was back there. Bony little fiends. Just gonna fire, I know it. Oh no! No! Oh man. I guess I'm starting over again. Man, wither well, skeletons are fast. He literally Sporta kicked me off the map. I better move before I get stabbed by a um Trident. Okay, he's gone. See ya, buddy. See, this isn't the most essential production because all I'm producing is barely anything. So I'm going to pr place more of these in hopes of increasing the amount of berries. What the heck are you doing on my island? What a good way to start episode nine, guys. Losing all the stupid stuff I had because someone said this is Forta and kicked me off. I'm going to keep these trees, actually. I'm going to go get some other trees. Why is there so many of them with tridents? Like, seriously. That's like... It's getting ridiculous. I remember getting massacred by two of them with tridents.
let's mine some wood. Still mining some wood. And it kind of sucks how I just died like that. Alright, craft some planks. I'm gonna head back to the base now. And the next time I get enough iron, I'm going back to the nether. Because I'm not going to the nether unprepared. That is definitely a rule in Minecraft that you should not break. It's not the golden rule, but it is a good rule. Never go to the nether unprepared. I was prepared because I had ar iron armor and an iron sword. I just got unlucky because someone decided to say this is Sporta. Already craft some gear. And we'll end it here. So. If you enjoyed it, comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the tournament announcement. Okay, guys, we are now in the tournament to draft, and today we're going to be going over the eighth round pick for tournament two. And today's tournament draft is brought to you by Incognitube.com. I finally said that right, because every other time... I tried to say it, I said it wrong. Alrighty. Now, this is the 8th draft pick. So after this one, 20%, no, not 20, 40% of the players have been drafted, will be, have been drafted. Alrighty. Now, let's go over today's player that is being drafted. And that player is Julia Hillary. Congratulations, you are the eighth person to enter my tournament, along with seven others. And those seven others include Huge Coconut, Goku Warrior 789, E Entertainment, Womi, PlayStation Europe, O Art Studios, and Bear Mythology. Those, and so now there are eight people in the tournament. But. There is still 12 spots remaining, which is around um, a week and five days worth of drafting remaining. So you still have 12 chances to get into this tournament. The more videos you have, the more likely you'll be in getting into my tournament. If you side with Incognitube, then you're probably going to have to be in popular and have less than 100, video, 100 views on a video in order for it to have a chance to get in that way. But if, if you are more popular than that, then you're probably going to want to go with um, ytrollet.com as those are completely random. It's kind of like Major League, Minor League, and you just combine them into one. So that everyone has a chance. Alrighty. Here's what everyone needs to do. Everyone needs to get ready. Because if you're not ready, you will lose the tournament. So far, I think... Um, around... Um, six out of eight of you are ready, I think. I'm not sure. It's either five or six, but... For the rest of you who are still not ready, you need to get ready unless you are probably not going to win the tournament. So, I said, in the, oh wait, I forgot to explain to what ready means. If you are considered ready, you have at least 10 videos. You will need to have at least 10 videos in order to win this tournament. Otherwise, you're going to lose. Because if, because I do not tolerate zero videos... And here's how it works. Your most recent video will be the one 
to count for your for a certain rounds for a round um the vid video but you can only use it for one round and no others which is why you need 10 videos because there's 10 rounds Alrighty, now let's go over the rules. Tournament two rules, there are. T rule number one, 20 competitors. Right now we have now drafted eight of them. We still got another 12 to go. So we're almost halfway done. Ra rule number two, there are 10 rounds. I already went over this, but there are gonna be 10 rounds that you each compete against before the tournament ends. Rule number three, there are two people eliminated per round, which means every round, it'll go down by twos. Rule number four, there are two draft sites. Today we used incognitube.com, which is the second site. Tomorrow we'll be using um, ytroulette.com, which is site number one. We're pretty much just alternating between the two. Alrighty, rule number five. There is one player eliminated on the final round. Not two. Which means round ten, only one player is being eliminated. And rule number six, there is only one winner. Not two winners like you might expect if you somehow come up with that assumption. But there is only one winner. And that's it. Only one. There's not two. And not 20 either. There's not going to be 20 winners either. Alrighty. Good luck to the eight of you who are currently in my tournament. And good luck to those other 12 who will be in the future, in who will be drafted into my tournament in the future. Rather it be tomorrow or 11 days from now. Or even 12 days from now. Whatever it will be, you will be that lucky person if you get drafted. And I will see you guys tomorrow.